I gotta keep the tension on it. I'm Greg Ovens. I'm Amos Rodriguez. And this is the 30 day survival challenge, Vancouver Island. There's only one rule. If you want to eat, you're gonna have to catch and cook it first. Uh, sure. Cheers, man. If you're just tuning in, don't forget to check out the link in the description below for the series playlist so you can start on episode one. And when this episode's over, check out that playlist again and you can watch Greg's side of the adventure. Okay, good morning. Again, it's a bit cloudy. I started working on my boy yesterday. We didn't catch any salmon yesterday, so I think we should catch some today. We're gonna hike to the fishing hole. Um, I think Greg wants to work in some traps. I wanna do a little fishing. I want to come back with enough fish so I can just sit and work on my bow for a couple of days. It will be a good one. We're hiking up to go to the fishing hole. Again, another cloudy, rainy mornings. The fish should be heating. It would be nice to catch at least one coho. But to get my daily limit of two will be even better. If we come back with more salmon for the smoker, Greg has been working really hard on the smoker and it's working for us. We want to cook some fish in the pan. We want to use the head and the skeleton for uh, soup. And we want to sun dry some fish and we want to smoke some more. So, fishing mission today. Let's go get set up, I guess. Yeah, don't break your head in here, remember. Remember that part. <laughs> remember that part, don't break your head trying to get to the spot. Slippery. He's a really strong fish, man. He's been fighting. Well, it's big. You don't want to lose this side. I gotta keep the tension on it. Just don't let him go. That's a spring. You think so? That's a spring. But no, it doesn't like, have. It's a big chin. It's, it's a big coho. Oh, maybe. It's a big oh, coho. No. It doesn't have. It look black. Oh, yeah, okay. It's a big coho. There you go. Well, we're eating now, thanks to you. We're eating now. That's your limit. That's my limit. Thank goodness it's his limit. Maybe I'll get a chance. Oh man, that was fun, eh? That was a big one, man. That, what a rush. 
Uh, it was, oh, I thought you were going to lose it when, when the lion hit the rocks? Oh man, we're not under the rocks and that's one of the things what I like about the setup I have. I have braided line and it can take a lot of abrasion. High dollar sushi quality meat, man. You can't get this out there. I mean, yum, yum, yum. Delicious. After you been hiking, fishing, working so much around camp, fish and soup is pretty top notch. It's really, really good, man. Mm, so good. If you want to smoke all the fish, that'll be better. Smoke is just way better way, better way to preserve it. Leftover fish, uh, fish head, and I'm gonna make soup tomorrow. Tomorrow morning to hydrate right away, just throw all of this in the pot, and make it really good. The mosquitoes are starting to come with a vengeance now. The sun is setting, so they, they don't care, they're out for dinner. There is a lot of them. Okay, a rainy, rainy, rainy day. That's a fish. That's fresh bear's cat. But this is what I wanted. I think this would make a really nice plate, a nice dish.
the handle almost made. I gotta polish it now. I gotta lower this flare a little bit and start working on the limbs. But the handle is almost there. Need to make it more ergonomical. And that's about it. Then I have to work on her on this area of the bow. I got something, just going to check the creek. Just a couple minutes mm -hmm. out there and soaked, completely soaking wet. Rain has been non-stop for hours now, as you can tell. But we're here, working a uh, camp and waiting out the rain. Amos Rodriguez Survival and Ovens Rocky Mountain Bushcraft are brought to you by Fowler's Makery Mischief Studios. Check out our shop here. And for the next video in the series, hit the link here. And don't forget to subscribe to Amos's channel and Ovens Rocky Mountain Bushcraft here. And thanks for watching the 30 Day Survival Challenge, Vancouver Island.